Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. We're doing your bonus. <laughs> How does it work? It's next 30 days. So there's a playlist. You can watch okay, any of the bonus reading. It's called next 30 days. You can watch it anytime. You know, if you resonate with the title, that's for you. Okay, so that's how it works. And this is just a you know a thank you from our little community over here, the tarot community. Okay, for always liking, sharing, and subscribing to your own read. It's not my life, it's yours. Okay. So continue supporting your pentacles. Okay. That's your affirmation. Every time you like the, you like it when you see that pentacle, like it right away. Okay. That's your life. Okay. So that's that one. So thank you very much. And then also um, at the end of the video, it's a recap of 2018. The last year, December, bi-weeklies will be there. Okay? So that's that one. Um, so this is just to, uh, like, you know, for you to get a catch up on the past. Where were you were? Where were you last year? Okay? So that's that. And then you're, so, you know, if you resonate with it, that's good. So that's that one. Um, Saturn webinar is in the description box. It's January 11. Make sure you already got in. It's, a, you know, it's like it's limited sitting. Uh, well, it's a webinar, but it's limited. Okay. So I will see you in class. Alrighty. Libra. Oh, we're going to get first our Kung Hei Fat Choi 2020. It's not a Chinese New Year, but with Sal. Okay. It's everyday fortune cookie. Here we go. Let's see here. Let's see what's going on with you. Oh, here we go. Let's see. From a Libra. Communication. Ooh! A reunion could bring love or a rekindling of friendship. Ooh! A lucky, uh, a lucky win seems likely. You're always lucky. Mm-hmm. Lucky in love, lucky. Lucky money, okay? Love you, lucky. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Do you want a reunion? Maybe it's just a high school reunion and it's the holiday. <laughs> okay. Someone's coming back. Communication. This oracle card is crazy. It like it vibes like a tarot. Okay. What are you? Okay. <laughs> uh, so that expect a message from someone. Okay. Now we're gonna get first this one. Okay, this is the deck. Uh, I forgot what it's called, but it is uh, I feel like it's a Green, green witch, green witch, green witch. Oh, I feel like it's that one. Let's see what's going on with you guys. Libra. Okay. Let's see with my Libra. Make sure you watch the recap. That's very important. You got here, page of ones. Oh, okay. So you're waiting for a communication. Yeah, so say what? You know, say what? Who's going to text me, Sal? Who's going to text me? Okay. Because I blocked that mother, so, mm-hmm, I have already let go, okay? But if you tell me that they get a message, why not, okay? Why not? So you're still open for communication, okay? Page of Wands are learning creativity. That one over there is about you, it's like, you know, learning a new hobby, okay? So I apply it to your fifth house, basically. Those are the um, you know, things, things that you enjoy, okay? I feel here like you're learning also to become a stylist. Okay. I love that, Libra. You're learning to dress up differently. I feel like you're trying to break the norms, okay, with regards to your aesthetics, okay? Who cares about, you know, if burgundy and mint green with a touch of fuchsia match, okay? I dress myself the way I want to, and it looks good, okay? Four of Pentacles. See, I knew you were trying to be thrifty also. Because <laughs> it's like, ooh, tightening of belt. Because there's a tightening of belt over there. And Four of Pentacles, you're really like, these are my coins. These are my coins. Okay. Good for the holidays. Be, th You know, it's just, when the holidays, burn the credit card. Okay. <laughs> burn it. Um, someone here is trying to... Um, I feel like they're waiting for your next move. Okay, like, because they know that you're basically keeping things to yourself. 
Um, because this person is looking like, okay, what's your next move? What is this person next move? They want to know because you're on, you're on, there. I'm 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 hearing you're on reverse. So meaning, if you are a person who's always out there with them, uh, making the move and stuff like that, they want to know. It's like, all right, what's the next step? What is the Libra going to do? Okay. So they won't make a move until you make a move. Okay, Libras. And you got your Six of Swords, but you're ignoring this person. And they're so surprised right now. It's like, how can the Libra ignore me? Okay, this is the pink elephant. Mm -hmm. If it's if it's a gift giving, it's white elephant. Okay. <laughs> Six of Swords. Um, can be a Leo also here. Or a Sun in Scorpio. You're in the whatever mode. Like, you want to talk to me, talk to me. If you want to talk to me, you can talk to me. I'll be here. You know where I'm at. And for them, it's just like, wait, what? You're just going to be like that? So they are so surprised with your action. Yep, and they will communicate. Ace of Swords, and that's communication. <laughs> wow, this oracle card is creepy as F. Mm -hmm. It's been resonating like crazy in the reads. So a very fiery communication. Okay, something that's gonna cut through the you know through butter right here. So it means like this person wants to tell you and they will call you out. They will call you out for ignoring them. Why you've been ignoring me, you haven't been in touch, you know that kind. Mm-hmm. Trying to soften the butter. Mm-hmm. What am I? Gusa? A Danish trying to soften me. I am a brioche, okay? <laughs> Rich and you know very, very much deadly. <laughs> okay. You got a king of wands, an Aries, page of swords, okay, or a Scorpio, fire sign. They're waiting for you to talk to them and they're wondering. It's like, because you're wondering over here, it's like, oh, well, you have to talk to me first. Ain't moving right here. Say what? Mm -hmm. That's that page of wands right there. And I feel like you're, you're, you're observing them also. So both people are heavily watching each other here. Heavily, heavily watching each other. Knight of Wands and the Sun card. Um, so they're seeing your next move here. It's like they're feeling like, oh, you're giving other people attention. You're having the time of your life. You keep going out. Like, you know, it's like it's not like out or drinking with friends like that. It's more like they see you healing and doing stuff, positive stuff for yourself. And they're very much in awe that, wait, you don't need me anymore for all of those. Before, you used to be dependent on me. This is what they're having right now. That's for their breakfast. Mm-hmm. Just saying. They've been served. Yeah. Like you've been glowing with a sun card right there. Knight of Wands, Sun, Sun in uh, you know, Sun and Sag, you have Knight of Wands with a Sun card, can be a Leo, like what I mentioned. Um, they feel that you are just going with the flow at the same time. And again, they're so in awe. I don't know what's in awe about that one. Mm-hmm. See, the devil card is right here. So it's me and the empress. So they don't even understand why you're not codependent anymore. Um, boo. Because I cut you off, Ace of Swords. I cut the shackle off. I found out about the truth. This person wants you to be always dependent on them with their little breadcrumbs. But you are a brioche Libra, okay? You ain't no regular bread, okay? You are an almond croissant. Okay, I'm from a boulangerie in France. Okay, love it, love it, love it, Libra. Okay, so because you are appearing as an empress, they are desiring you. You are a French macaron. Okay, so you are a premier in my bakery. Okay, so you are desirable, and this person is wondering. Okay, how do I get with the Virgo? Oh, with a Virgo? Mm -hmm. How do I get with the Libra? Wait, do you have a Virgo with you? Mm hmm. So the desire is strong, okay? They're weakening their knees. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let them shake. That's what I'd say. Mm -hmm. Ace of Swords, Page of Cups with the Knight of Cups. You've been cutting people off left and right. Welcome to the Libra world. <laughs> because you don't resonate with these people. The Page, hey! No, not you. Knight of Cups, hey! <laughs> no, not you. Okay. So you're all about the truth right now. I feel like you're just having fun. Okay. You're totally having fun. You're enjoying your freedom. And you're not about the lifestyle of being codependent. 
Okay? So, they don't know why. They don't know why you're not codependent. <laughs> I love that. So before you were though, like you were all about, you know, that devil card right there, the connection. I want you. I need you. I can't breathe. I don't have a life without you. Mm -mm. Libra is woke with the Ace of Swords. She's slaying like an empress. Yes. Abundant life. Feeling healthy. Had a recent hair color trimming, you know, going to the spa, shopping, you know, Venusian. Venusian. You're vibing like you. You know, you're at Makarka, basically, highest degree if it's Venus. But it's a natural lord. So it can be your at Makarka. Or you're just being you. Mm hmm. Venus in the house. And you slay. Because I slay. And I slay. Right, Libra? Love it when you slay. You always, you never fail. But this person is a failure. Just saying. Ace of Swords. The mother. They've been stalking. Wanting to communicate. We'll see what happens. Link down there in the description box as this person wants to talk to you. But I don't know if you want to talk to them because you are just basically... Okay. I got better things to do. Meaning, I have to wash my hair. Okay, so when they talk to you, I have to wash my hair. Okay, you want to go out? Mm. No. <laughs> That's what I call a Libra. <laughs> okay, so thank you very much guys for watching. Next to this is a recap, so stay tuned for that one. That will still help you in everything. For the link for the extended, it's right there. I'll see you in class, Saturn webinar. January 11. Bye, guys. Hi, Libra. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your award. This is your bi weekly Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter, December 1 to 16. Okay, this is for the Libra. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. Best friend. Mm, maybe you're waiting for your best friend to message you. Okay. Well, that's been like two years. I haven't talked to my best friend. Okay. I'll, I'll text him later. Here we go. What are you guys up to? Okay, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's see here. Let's see. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. 1 to the 16. Here we go. Guy the five of spades. Let me see here what's going on. Um, you feel like there are things right now that is going well, but there are more things that is not going well. Okay, this can be your other person. Um, I feel the energy is about, um, okay, it's like, it's almost like the two of you are going well. Most are the parts out, um, external of your life. That's not, that's the part where it's not doing so well. Okay. Like, okay, everything, like, you know, like we're talking, so, I mean, no, he's cool, she's cool, but there are things right now that are contradicting what I'm doing. Okay, I'm going to see here. Oh, four of spades, yeah? See, two are going the same direction, but it's almost like either you or this person has to take a wing. Like, okay, I'll help you, okay? Or they're supporting you on something. A lot of things bothering you right now can be at work or, you know, in different situations in your life. Because um, I feel like there's, uh, you know, like they're agreeing, okay? They're agreeing over here. Let me see here. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's interesting. So this person that you're connecting with, they agree with you and you feel very supported, okay? Very, very supported. That's a five to the 10. Um, so for me, it's like, it's like, okay, it's like as long as, uh, you know, it's like as long as we're okay, we're cool, we're not fighting, everything is agreeable in, on, our, on, on both our end, then we're cool, you know, then everything is fine. However, you feel there's more things right now again that is just like, okay, it's like, why is this not working out? You know, it's like, I tried, you know, it's like, I'm trying to fix my house, I'm trying to, you know, it's like my car, you know, family, it's just like all, all overwhelming over here coming at you. Let me see here. There are nine of spades. Um, they do worry about you. Um, it's more of a situation where it's like, okay, um, I'm here for you, but I also have other things in, in, you know, in my life. So the person you're dealing with, they have other things in their life. Okay, so nine of clover over here that they're trying to attend it, but they're not even telling you this. They're being supportive to you. Okay, let me see here, other person. Oh, wow, and you like you like it. You like that this person chooses you from the situation rather than themselves. Okay, so someone here is basically um, thinking of you in different ways. It's just like 
Um, you have a partner who's, uh, whose energy is about, okay, I'm going to be there for you if you need me, but you don't even know, like, I'm going through some stuff. But this can be also the other side, okay? Sorry, I just took a shower. This hair. <laughs> okay. Let me see here. Another person. Yeah, Queen of Diamonds. So they're, oh, wow. That's pretty good. Because they're very caring right now to you. Um, you feel like you're be someone is looking after you or you're looking after them. You know, it can be a Virgo that I'm seeing here or Capricorn Taurus. Um, I see here that um, this person right now is is being the person, you know, if you, if you have a void inside your heart, they're the one supporting you. They're the one being there for you. It's almost like there's something really missing right now in your heart chakra from what I'm feeling here. Libras, let me see here. If, you, if there's something also there, then you're probably missing the person that you're connecting with and then you're struggling with life. <laughs> I like that because they do give you hope and you have your what's divine is a star card see you have a very good partner congratulations I'm happy for you um this is a person who give you hope there's something missing there you know this is a healer energy also the star card um I feel here there's a number seven so this this person sees you as their partner and they're not gonna back down on the situation however it's just like you have to be more sensitive also it's like they're they have some stuff right now inside their head that they're not telling you because all attention right now is is with you. I'm not sure if you're brooding, you know, because this is, for me, it's like there's an energy that is brooding, okay? There's an energy that's like, okay, um, I don't know what's going on, you know, it's just like I, I'm worried about, you know, for example, you're worried about rent, you're worried about, um, I feel you're, like you're worried about your family, your siblings, your, your, your dad, your mom. It's like you're taking care of all this stuff or they're taking care of you or your partner is. And then for you, it's just like, okay, like this is just too much. And, and then the other person over here, it's just like, it's okay, I'm here, I support you. And they're not giving up on this right now with the Queen of Diamonds. So for them, it's like, so I, I need to be the bigger person so that then, you know, whoever is here, they will be okay. All right? So I'm going to continue this reading. Uh, Libra, as we move forward together with, you know, there's a lot of hope. Okay, it's also wish granted, it's an acquiring energy. You can be connecting with an air sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius. Um, and then we'll see where it goes. Alright, this is uh, December 1 to 16. Thank you very much, Libra, for watching. Bye.